build something. This is so simple, so motivating, but in the grand scheme of programming, it is often one of the hardest things to do as a beginner. I don't know what to do. I don't know where to start. I want to, but I don't know if I'm good enough yet. Everyone has their own reasons behind not building something, but this mindset is the only thing that's holding you back. So how can you learn programming to make the words build something even more simple? What most people do when they just start out programming is think, man, I can just buy a course. Hell, you've probably bought some yourself. You've probably checked out the free coding websites or the demos. You've probably done all of that already. And while this is one way to go about learning how to code, all you'll end up doing is following the same videos, building the same calculator alongside someone, building clone apps of your favorite websites. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool to show off to your friends like, hey, look what I built. But did it really show you anything? Did you really learn anything? It probably makes you feel like you retained a lot of information. But take away the code along video and I ask you to build that same calculator, would you be able to do it? Odds are probably not. And that's because when you're going through these videos, you don't have to figure things out on your own. You didn't have to sit there and Google and, and sit there and try and solve a bug for 30 minutes to an hour. You didn't build something, you copied something. You followed along something, you didn't build something. Now I don't want you to think that I'm being negative and saying that you're wasting your time. Trust me, you're not. All of these things, the tutorials, the videos, they do give you knowledge. And most of all, they get you comfortable with the concept of programming. Sitting down, slamming out code on a keyboard. But like I said, and everyone here on YouTube will tell you, they don't teach you to become a developer. Because what is a developer? It's more than slamming out code on keyboard. A developer is a problem solver, and coding tutorials do not teach you how to solve problems. So going through one or two of these videos is, is it's okay, it's recommended, but don't get trapped in tutorial hell where you're endlessly re-watching videos, watching the same videos, coding videos over and over and over again, retaining none of the information. Don't go build five different clones of Uber, or Disney, or Airbnb. Build one or two, and then start thinking about what you want to build. And guys, I'm not saying your personal project needs to be the next Facebook or a rocket ship. It needs to be something simple. Heck, it, it can even be a clone of your favorite website. It really can. But the key, the big picture, what I'm trying to get at is to do it yourself. Build something yourself. That's where the real learning comes. That's where you earn the title of a programmer by putting your blood, sweat, and tears into a project. By learning as you go along with your project, having to Google things and figure things out. You have to add a navigation bar to your project. Google it, look it up, try and figure it out. Don't go follow a tutorial that teaches you how to do it. Read the documentation, educate yourself. That way you retain the information. It's all about learning, and most people wanna cheat themselves out of that process. This isn't a get rich quick scheme. This is a life changing learning process. So just build something. I hope this video is crystal clear. You know the steps, you know what you need to do, and you just have to get started. Take some time to find what you wanna build and build it. I hope you guys like this video. Do me a favor, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button so we can continue to make more videos like this. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to see what you guys build, and I will see you in the next video. See you later.